Hello, today I'm testing uh, Dr. Webb um, antivirus. Um, heard a lot of good things about it. Um, I'd like to put it to the test, so I'm going to start by installing it. And so far, so good. Alright, so I'll be right back once it finishes installing. Alright, so we're back. We have uh, um, Dr. Webb's Cured up and running, um, all up to date. And uh, I'm going to put it to the test. I'm going to open up uh, the malware domain list and put it to the test. Um, seems to like asking me a lot of questions with the firewall. Um, which I should probably create a rule. I just want to test it out. 76 megabytes in the background. Um, most certainly eating up a little bit of uh, of memory, so small footprint, not so much. It's uh, actually eating up quite a bit. It's not slowing down the system all that much, but it is definitely uh, eating up a lot of memory. So let's see if it's worth that memory. Let's go to malware domain list. I'm just going to create a new rule with this Internet Explorer. Um, Oh, it doesn't ask me for the Internet Explorer anymore. But, alright, so let's test some viruses. I'll copy that one. Put it in here. Try it out. Nothing there. Dead link. Go down from executable. There's one. Copy, paste it in there. And another dead link. Take that one, copy it, put it in there. Alright, here we go. Alright, so block malicious program. Just make sure. Nope, so it stopped it. It's good news. Try another one. So number two. Test. And that one's not available. Try this one. This one will be number two if it goes through. A lot of dead links, which is good. Alright, will this one work? It's taking its time. Try this one in the meantime. Nope. Dead link. Try this one. Alright, so it has stopped that one. Let's try another one. So two out of two so far. Three out of three. Four to four. That one was a dead link. Five out of five. It's good sounding. Run that one, see if it finds anything. Ooh, interesting. Alright, so it stopped five out of six. It let one through. That's the same one. So it let one through by the looks of it. I'll just keep trying a couple. Five out of six. Appears to be maybe a dead link. Yeah, it's a dead link. Same one. Let's try this one. Dead link. Tons of dead links today. Makes my job a little bit longer. Follow 
not found. Dead rank. Try this one. So, so far, five out of six. It stopped. Missed one. Here's another one. Found that. All right, so it looks like it stopped. Huh. Okay, well, it did actually let it run, but it stopped a little bit of what it was doing. So I'm going to leave it at that. So. I'd say 5 out of 7, uh, possibly 6 out of 7 it stops. So not bad, actually. That's kind of what I expect, um, you know, is to do that. I'll make sure the malware bytes, so I'm going to allow that. Make, wor make sure the malware bytes actually does update and uh, run a full system scan. Again, allow. Do an update. Check for updates. Allow. Wow, latest up to date. So I'm going to do a quick scan and I'll be right back. All right, so uh, our scan is just about done. Perfect. And uh, it found five. Uh, one Trojan horse. Instant, interesting. Um, it is in the, uh, in the temporary internet files. We are getting some things there. Double check. Just waiting. 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 All right, well, it's taking its time. Try that one. You'd think it would knock it up right now. It doesn't seem like it's doing anything, so um, it doesn't look like this Dr. Webb. Uh, wow, look at that. It's definitely infected right now, um, and uh, Dr. Webb isn't largely stopping it. It is trying its best, but... Uh, uh, definitely not something I would primarily use. There are kind of different things here that are being noticed. Antivirus disable. Very interesting. Reboot. And my Windows won't detect uh, an antivirus, which is interesting. Um, but yeah, overall, I'm not going to rate it badly. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10, maybe 6 out of 10. Um, 6.57. Somewhere in around there. Um, the reason being because it did stop quite a few websites. It only let one, maybe two in. So, I mean, I this isn't that bad. I do like Dr. Webb. I think it's a, a decent product. I don't like that it's kind of hard to uh, get through. I mean, I had to pay for this to get the uh, updates. Um, I had troubles getting the demo, 30-day demo. So it kind of got annoying that I couldn't even just try it. But um, they do offer demos, just apparently not to everyone. Um, not every time. But, uh, you know, I did buy it, and uh, it still didn't do very good. So uh, rating at 6.5 to 7, definitely no good. Komodo beats it. Uh, Norton beats it uh, for sure. All right, so uh, that's it. Signing off.